Don't mind the balloons. We kind of had a party. So this is this is um that's my Christmas tree out there. Pray for her, send her more love because she's kind of like <laughs> fragile and brittle out there and she's turning brown. Not good. I guess that's a little update with my Christmas trees. So I hate balloons. They make me like I don't I like balloons, but like touching them makes makes me cringe because I'm scared they're gonna pop. I hate it. Anyways. Party 8 30. Actually I've been up for like an hour already. Just about. I got up 7 30. I've never really done anything like vloggy. But um a few videos I had dropped of, of me like in the car and like doing like playlist videos or what was the other one I did? Uh oh, oh my update on 2021. Which I kind of enjoyed, which is kind of cringe because am I trying to be a vlogger now? <laughs> Everybody's been kind of like coming out of quarantine, like getting back to work and working from work, not home no more. But fortunate enough right now where I can just be home working. Um, so I don't do much in my in my days and I really don't have much to show you guys, but I wanted to vlog and I wanted to do something different. Yeah, I mean, so I try to get up early. I used to get up early and I used to make it, oh, the air freshener. <sighs> Fucking airwick, love them. <laughs> but since quarantine had hit i you know try to squeeze in that extra hour and then that extra hour becomes that hour and a half and that that's about it like the latest i ever wake up was not nine o'clock nine a.m and that was still a little too late because i would even like start to get like headaches you know when you like sleep too much and you like get headaches or is that just me after my coffee i usually just you know hang around the computer either you know responding to emails or whatever i have to do for the business but oh, i definitely wanted to show you guys when we had the snowstorm oh that's what's left to our snowman what happened snow woman we we built a snow woman okay and that right there next to it was supposed to be a couch one seer does anybody else keep the toothpaste like as low like there is nothing in there psych you thoughts look Wait, there might not be anything else in this. I've done it too many times. Psych. Look, like, I just wanted to do this, but like this is not something I truly like to see. Like in movies or vlogs, it's like, don't show me this. One. I don't know why I don't want an apocalypse to happen. Because I will forever have chapped lips. Oh my goodness. You guys eat before you brush your teeth or do you eat? after you brush your teeth i feel like people eat after they brush their teeth right i eat after sometimes actually i'm like if i'm freaking starving i will eat nah because i don't i have a new thing where i don't even like eat breakfast anymore like that's that's just something new don't ask welcome to the mess of a wannabe closet because i don't have a big closet i just bought this thing which i'm pretty sure i made a video on so oh my god it's hot right here i'm having a freaking hot flash with the sun if you might ask why it looks like i'm almost touching the ceiling it's because i am <laughs> i'm standing on my bed um so ghetto as you can see this motherfucking closet mostly jackets sweatpants hoodies <laughs> that's my that's my style with quarantine it's gotten worse too because now all we want to wear is sweatpants and hoodies like last last friday uh, i had a pair of jeans on and that shit did not last i went out and then came home and then had with sweatpants on i was not sitting in them jeans around the house that's bad it's a problem i promise it doesn't look like I just had like a Popeye sandwich and didn't wipe my mouth. <laughs> yeah, well, that happened before. Um, not the the grease on the lips, but I was eating them in the car and a crumb off my sandwich dropped on my sweatpants and it stained a grease mark on my sweatpants. That's why you should not eat in the car. 
that is a good tip they are just thriving look at this wow this outfit i pulled out yesterday and i've had it for a minute but it doesn't fit the pants were way too tight and i, I didn't even bother trying on the shirt but i think i feel like it might fit but i feel like it might be a little a little tight hmm hmm a couple of my favorite movies are by quentin tarantino <laughs> toronto <laughs> let's call it toronto <laughs> Would this look weird if I like pair it with like sweatpants? I got this. I love this. I got it for 20 bucks in Forever 21. It's my favorite color. A riding shirt. I always wanted to like dress up in something like this and wear it out. Like like I'm well and like how all these like celebrities do. But I guess I just don't have the cojones to do it. Like, I'll wear it around the house, but not actually out. Is that weird? That's kind of weird. I should wear it out. Yeah, I should. The winner. Um, so, I'm feeling these guys. But then I'm feeling like I want to spice things up and just go with red. <laughs> I like how I picked out black as I'm wearing black. I'll get that little, little snake while I get ready. All of these things. Underrated. A little ASMR. Oh, doing makeup. Not really a thing for me. Because I don't know what I'm doing. And you think I would have, like, took time during this quarantine to learn? Well, not really. Still, not... Not that intrigued, not that interesting. Anyways. Like, literally, I don't know to the point where, like, my sister would buy shit for me. Well, not buy shit, but, like, recommend what I need. When you get to a point when somebody in your life just annoys you, and once your soul is irked by it, you can't come back from it. <laughs> so that anything that person does is just like, why? You question it all. I just feel like I'm that type of person, like, once I'm, like, got a certain feeling about you, it doesn't go away. Like, it doesn't go back to the way it was. Maybe it's the Scorpio in me, but I can't. Which I should probably work on that. Yeah. I don't feel like it's about forgiveness. I feel like it's about just pushing out the wrong people or what you just don't want in your life. Right? That, that's 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 the mature thing to do, right? Not, not saying not to forgive, but saying to just, like, be mature about it. That's all. Does anybody else get those ashy-ass eyebrows? Like, what is going on? <laughs> Why is the game? Like, I dead ass don't even know what I'm gonna be doing here. What brought all that up, too, is just because, like, me and my sisters were just talking about somebody. That is just, like, how I'm feeling right now. <laughs> yeah, let's call this the, the get ready truth. Because, jeez.
First off, I've only been out here for five minutes and my hands feel like they have frostbite. I'm freezing. Second, did you see me? I had to move all these cars to get to my car. One car, but whatever. Um, third, freaking door is frozen shut. I go through the passenger door. Oh my God. It's so cold. My truck hasn't even started since the snowstorm. So it's been like this for like five days just sitting here and I'm being lazy right now because I don't even want to climb over to the driver's side it's cold all right so now I'm about to go to Acme to pick up a few things for dinner because we're having I'm not really I'm not really the cook I can cook my mom's cooking but she's cooking Spanish spaghetti so you'll see that later my mom they call it her family. They call it Spanish spaghetti. Don't ask me where that came from, okay? They just made the name up and it's just bomb ass spaghetti with sofrito and it's just like, it's not typical spaghetti. Anyways, that's all I have. Okay, it's good, it's bomb, whatever. So I'm going to uh, Acme to pick up a few things, but I'm trying to wait till the truck warms up some because it's so cold. And if I get there, I'm not gonna be able to open up my door. <laughs> I'll get a taco. <laughs> It's not too bad either. It's only 11 a.m. on the dot. Oh, I just turned 101. That's gotta mean something. But I put my truck ahead, so it's actually 11. Does anybody else do that on their in their cars? So you're never late. You put it a minute ahead, a minute or two ahead, but mine's only a minute ahead, I think. You only put it a minute ahead, so you're never late, so you know you're always, you're always on time. Punctuality is key, okay? Never late. Um, make a good impression there's no excuse laziness if you're late I'm just kidding shit, shit happens whatever I'm gonna stay it always tells you how hard this shit is <laughs> dang it I don't want to step on my freaking leather I don't want to step on my leather so I'm gonna do this I'm gonna go My mirrors won't come out. I'm so fucked. <sighs> I'm out of shape. This is bad. Literally just moving from seat to seat. A little quick sushi fix. Don't shop right. Listen, don't don't sleep on them because shop right be having some good shit. I'm about to be a freaking animal eating with my freaking hands to do what's necessary 101. <laughs> Eat with your hands. Mm. Oh, that's good. I like shop right because they be doing like um extra sesame seeds on their on their rolls i like the sesame seeds walmart walmart has these good um lollipops like in the food section with like sesame seeds in them because i think i'm pretty sure it's a spanish candy i forgot what they're called though i don't remember paleta paleta i don't fucking know we had like a big snowstorm that we had like fucking a foot of snow and then it washed away and then like in two days after we got another storm which we got a nice like two inches maybe but right after everything it like started to mount and now we're supposed to be getting another storm tomorrow but by the time you see this video it's gonna be today these things are so good Wasabi got me. Oh, holy shoot. It made me cry. That was not being dramatic. That was hot. We just had um buffalo 
wow wings yeah that's what it's called right buffalo wow wings yesterday or two days ago and um we ordered the mango habanero do you guys remember that challenge that they were doing with the uh, buffalo wow wings the hottest buffalo wow wings or some shit what wing what sauce was that was it just like buffalo i don't remember what sauce that was but mango habanero mango habanero wings from them those things are hot if that if those were the wings that were in the challenge then oh my gosh people weren't exaggerating they're really 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 spicy and i like spicy food we're fucking we're fucking mexican so you know our intestines are built for that okay our stomachs are built for the spice but you just here i'm telling you man hey stomach what's up Ooh, diablo, mija. that shit was spicy it was the devil sauce Second. Oh, if you guys were wondering, when I got to the store, the driver's door did open. So that was good. But I did sit in the parking lot for like, like an extra five minutes until like the window could go down. <laughs> oh my gosh. It's crazy. I need a remote start. Mm. Mm, 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 mm. Usually, Usually I will go to the mall for those, for the California rolls and the um, chicken teriyaki rolls. Oh my god, so good! And I will grab that and, and my uh, and my smoothie from um, what's that place called? California Shakes. I grabbed the green one with the spinach and all. That one's so good. This gum has been in my truck for the longest time. I forgot what it tastes like. Not that good if I didn't eat it that much, right? This gum is frozen. Smashed. That tastes a little old. I got a candy in the middle. It's good actually. That second piece tasted a little funky. It's 12 o'clock right now. I mean, I got a few things to do on the computer, but that's probably all I'm gonna really do tonight, to be honest. Maybe get on some Call of Duty. What a bl blurring, I was gonna say. What a blurring. What a blurring vlog. What a boring vlog. Look how cute this is. We got this from Far Below. It's so cute, right? It's like a nice quality box too. Wow. I'm actually about to text Lexi to see if she wants to play. Okay, if I don't see you guys later on, then this is me saying peace out. I hope you enjoyed my vlog. And my official vlog, huh? This is my first official vlog. Okay, let's see you. Let's see you. Oh, I see you. I'd like to see you here, but I gotta go.